Hi guys, AK Movies here. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm gonna do a movie review with you. I watched today. So this movie came out 2018. It's an action movie, action packed movie. I watched for the first time. It stars Tom Cruise, Andrew Car Carwell, who was in Superman. We so have Simon Pegg, Rick Graham, Rhymes. And Rebecca Ferguson, you know what I'm talking about, guys. It's the Mission Impossible Fallout. So, I watched this movie today, guys. My thoughts were oh, just amazing, fantastic action. So, it, yeah, this movie delivers brilliant performances by all the cast and the scenes. My favorite scene was the climax scene when the two choppers. Crash into each other and land up into the in the caves and uh, my f favorite scene is the f end fight scene, the climax scene between Ethan Hurt and uh, Henry Cavill fighting each other. This helicopter you can see, guys. So yeah, this movie was shot in Berlin, Paris. So you see in London as well and um, Kashmir and other places. So my first ever movie was, uh, I think it was the best Tom Cruise st starter from the others. First, first, first movie was great as well. So I need to rewatch that. Second one, people didn't like. It was all right. Third one was good as well. I enjoyed. Ghost Portugal. I still need to see. And the other one, the fifth one as well. Still need to see that as well. I've seen bits and bobs, but I need to see that. So finally, was the Fallout, the sixth movie in the franchise, the Mission Impossible series, one of the best films they made. So I pretty enjoyed. So starts off in the hospital and see this guy. And uh, yeah, the, this guy with long hair. I forgot what the character name, but yeah. Starts the mission from the, and you have this gang returning: Simon Pegg, Rick Grimes, the. Rebecca Ferguson, he had a new character in it, Henry Cavill. So, uh, fantastic uh, mission. Also, another mission, the, uh, Tom Cruise ride the bike. So, this this scene I loved as well. And, uh, and she tried to kill the uh, Tom Cruise, Ethan Hunt. So, yeah, it was Rebecca Ferguson. So yeah, I also like the, the bathroom scene fight. The first that Japanese guy, martial arts. Yeah, because I um, heard the honey cold world is going to be bad. Yeah, first they work as a team and all that. So they work as a team, even heat and all, even hunt, sorry guys. And yeah, they go each other, get along with each other. Yeah, then he changed switch sides. We'll see of Alec Baldwin, who leads Tom Cruise's mission and all that. Yeah, but suddenly he got killed and all that. Yeah, this is the scenes I loved. That bathroom fight, like that, and the climax scene, and this scene as well. Goes into the office building and all that. Yeah, he smashes the window, jumping from the window. Yeah, one of the best films. That scene was good as well, the jumping. Tom Cruise has everything as a Mission Impossible. He's the right character for the movies. This one was the fantastic movie. So the best action thriller of the year. I totally agree. And this is the description. Some missions are not a choice on a dangerous assignment. So he chooses dangerous assignment. Recover stolen plutonium. So he recovers that bomb, but they try to... Stop the bomb, cutting the wire and all that. So he goes into dangerous missions. Tom Cruise, Ethan Hunt and chooses to save his team. So he saves his team, takes risks for himself, completed the mission. Allowing nuclear weapons, nuclear weapons fall into the hands. Deadly network of skilled operators instead of destroying intent. Civilians knew with the world of risk. Eaton has the AMF team. Simon Peck does that. And you have Big Rhymes. 
Rebecca Ferguson as well, who forced to become reluctant, reluctant partners with the hard hitting CM agent Henry Caval. Him is the agent, so race against stop the nuclear fallout. So they try to stop the nuclear fallout. There's never been a threat or more destructive or stunts, more jaw dropping. It was jaw dropping, and the film is critics calling the mission best mission. Total film, Jason Graham. I totally agree with Jack Duck person. The hundred percent agree. This is one of the best Mission Impossible films released in twenty eighteen. So yeah, I think this girl was in Hobbs and Shaw. Vanessa something her name was. I've saw seen her before. I think is in. Yeah, stick it down in the comments. She was. I think she was in Hobbs and Shaw. Movie with Dwayne Johnson and Stratum Stratum's sister in that film. So yeah, so that's good. She's and I didn't know she was in this. So good to see Henry Cavill's different side. He usually plays DC Superman in Justice League and Jack Snyder cut. I still need to see that. So yeah, this is a fifth twelve. And yeah, I think this is the best uh, uh, Tom Cruise movie out there. Mission Fallout, so they tried to stop that bomb and I cut, yeah, and all that. Rebecca Ferguson joins the team with her, him, with Ethan Hunt, and the gang. Trying to stop this guy and this guy, they got this kid down, the beard guy, and also captured him and all that. Yeah, and uh, yeah, because the gunshots are happening, the goons are happening, and they save this uh, cop speaking in, in in French, I think. In Berlin, in in Paris, yeah, they speak French, and the uh, translate saves her because the police uh, woman gets shot, and they, um, he shoot these other members, other bad people, so yeah, that scene as well, yeah, he did some good shot, the bathroom scene as well, yeah, where he got up and still fight it, so yeah, this best stunts. Like I say, it's the best action hero in this one. After watching this, this is the best Mission Impossible I enjoyed and loved. All the cast were good. All the, I mean, this this woman was good. Her was good as well. Yeah. Angela Bassett, something her name is. Yeah. So yeah, this scene as well. I remember Simon Pegg and all that. So pretty awesome movie. The, the police chase as well was good. So they have the fight in the pub and to see her for the first time in the film enters in and she butters him and he butters those bad guys, goons and all that in the club when the music goes and all that. Because this scene comes as well, Rebecca Ferguson. I always thought, who's this? And uh, she showed her face it was Rebecca Ferguson. And she got run down by Tom Cruise's car, this car. Yeah, this car was BMW, old BMW car, so yeah, it was a good movie, I enjoyed it, fantastic uh, action by Tom Cruise, dangerous stunts did, this building one as well, and uh, other things, the climax scene and the two choppers one, at the end, yeah, it was a good twist and tail story, so yeah, he was good, most of the film, with the guys, and then he kills, he kills Alec Baldwin, I must uh, yeah, that's sad, he got stabbed, so yeah, then he changes switches, then he changes him, then you get him, yeah, then the, Ethan Hunt tried to find him and chase him, then they finally find in an helicopter, then he shoots these guys and beats them up and he rides that chopper, and they landed in the, in the mountains where, the, where they landed, where the parachute, plus this parachute scene came as well. Them to go in this mission, this one, yeah. Let me show you guys that one, yeah. That picture you see, yeah. That partial scene was another stunner, yeah. De Henry Cavell and uh, Infant Hunt going together, and and he said, you, you lose some oxygen, he tried to do something with his mask he had, and then he f safely landed, finally got the safely. So that scene was good as well. Old cops of Jason after and all of the Berlin scenes were good. Paris scenes, yeah, the UK scene. Then they go on the Kashmir and they find this another lady and all that. Yeah, then the end queen he survived after that. He landed in a helicopter, crushed badly. 
we got some cut and bruises, but yeah, we try to fight with Henry Cavill, then he goes after the villain. So like the hero does. Like I said, the hero always wins. Whatever shapes and sizes come, but always villain lose. Whatever the story, whatever movie you're watching, always the good guys win. So it's a five star. I enjoyed this movie. So yeah, best mission in the franchise. So let's see when they make the the seventh part of Tom Cruise Mission Impossible series. So I have every film. So I will need to see the um, Ghost Portugal and the other one. The fifth one. Rogue Nation. So I need to see Rogue Nation as well. And I've seen this one. It came on TV last night. I didn't see it. And yeah. So I watched this today. So give my thoughts of this movie. I give it. I give it five out of five. Otherwise, no stars. I will give it um, ten out of ten. So I'm gonna give it five out of five. Full stars. Fantastic acting. The the produced as well by Tom Cruise. And we cover cover was good. As the bar guy, you have Rebecca Ferguson. And you have um, Simon Pegg, Rick Grimes. And the chopper scene was my favorite and all the climax scene. Yeah. All the scenes were good in the film. I enjoyed. Yeah. When she mentioned this Vanessa girl, Tom Cruise, and it's not to chat, chat, and all that. And he has two bro one brother, two brothers, I think, mean, one brother. So, yeah. It's a good story. Best mission from other franchises. My opinion is the best one. So finally was the Tom Cruise Mission Impossible Fallout came out 2018. I pretty really enjoyed this movie guys. Stick it down in the comments what's your favorite uh, Tom Cruise movie or Mission Impossible series. This one has to be my favorite. This one. Definitely my favorite Tom Cruise um, Mission Impossible series. One of the best movies out there. So finally seen it. So yeah, all the scenes, all the stunts, everything was good, the storyline, and yeah. And they got managed to, at the end, the beard guy was another beard guy, and the film got uh, captured, captured by the cops and all that. Yeah, and Rebecca Ferguson did some good stunts, fighting as well, scenes at the end. So yeah, pretty cool f movie, fantastic action, blockbuster movie ever made hope they made the seven part the seven part might be even good as well tom cruise and all that is looking amazing in his age doing the stunts and all that fantastic he's the best choice for the mission impossible so that's my review for the tom cruise mission impossible fallout i'll give it five out of five so yeah hope you like subscribe and share i'll see you in the next video guys take care bye